I've left um, CJ and Lucy at home because uh, I'm working this morning and it is awful weather. I just, oh. April showers I suppose. It's not a great day like I know about it but it is what it is. This is without doubt the most boring part of my job. Picking staples out of every ticket so I can put it through the scanner. It is flat out impossible to vlog in that office. I was trying to do some sort of talky talky to the camera whilst I was picking staples out of every advice note that we have, or nearly every advice note. I just get inter interrupted every five seconds. It's like, John, what do we call these slabs? John, what are these ones? John, where do we keep these? Do you know where the brushes are? No, oddly. We're done. Morning finished. Now to get back home, pick up the boy, off to see Nanny Chris. I hope he's been alright for Lucy. He should have. He's really good for Lucy. I think he just generally behaves better if it's one on one than he does if he's got a bit of an audience. He can be a bit of a handful but one on one he seems to be okay. So hopefully Lucy's had a fine morning of it. Everybody's happy and it will continue on for the rest of the day. Okay sunshine. Move your magic, man. Right. Bless you. See you. Tomorrow? What time is it at again? Half ten o'clock it starts. Ten o'clock, no, half ten. Ten o'clock, I'll meet you there. Right, okay. Right. See you tomorrow. CJ? See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. I love you, buddy. Be good for Nanny, yeah? Good man. Yeah. Obviously, he doesn't mind staying, does he? Drive carefully, sunshine. That's always mother. Okay. See you later. Bye bye. Bye. Right, Mum's having the boy. So he's staying at Nanny Chris's for the night. Oh god. And that's that. So back home, back to Lucy. Present. Now you're making me sad. <laughs> <laughs> Can we watch it? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Thank you. There you go. Things I do for love. I do anything for you, in spite of it all. <laughs> you only sing like that because you're recording. That's probably not going to make it in. Let's be honest. We should go on the X Factor. <sighs> oh, sugar, honey, iced tea. Even though. Oh. <laughs> Trousers. So Cameron's at Nanny's. It was a wee bit of a pain today, but hey, he's on half term. He's excitable. He's not exactly short on energy anyway, bless him. So, tonight's beer. I've opened it already. I'm getting well ahead of myself. Sharps Brewery Atlantic Exceptional Pale Owl. Look at that, that's what it looks like. 87%? No, four and a half. Not like you. What do you mean? Not like me, cheek. It says here a load of old rubbish, actually. Oh, that's a great review. Well, well they normally give you like a, oh, ah, hey, here we are. Here we are, found it. Uh, taste note, deeply golden in color. Atlantic has a vibrant fruity aroma. Redolent of lime zest to mango. The oh, you might like this. Yeah. The flavour is harmonious balance of barley sugar and grapefruit. Oh, hello. Damn. I think Lucy might like this one more than me. 
I actually did my usual, well, not my usual, what has become a bit of a normal thing for me. I said to Cameron, you're gonna have to pick a beer. And he kept pointing at Hobgoblin. I was like, I've done that one. Yeah, but it sounds cool. Yeah, but I've done that one. I don't think he grasped the concept. Cool. You can smell all the citrusy stuff. It is golden in colour. Stop looking at the screen, you halfway. So, uh, God, it smells well citrusy. Oh. You know, I've tasted other beers that taste exactly the same as this, that don't make all these bold claims about being like grapefruit and stuff like that. It's just, it's good. And it is good beer before you start on me. It's just not what it says on the side of the bottle. Here, my love, try some of that. How's that for you? It's fruity. Isn't it? Get a bit of mango. But it reminds me of um it reminds me of a more bitter version than Golden Glory. Oh really? The Golden Glory is a sweeter taste. Oh. Whereas it could be I've just had a bit of chocolate. There you go. I've just had a bit of chocolate though, so all, ah, the, that's true. all, all, all the sweet tones are gone in your mouth. I think it's alright, but it's not amazing. Forgetting the description, it's okay. It's pretty good. I'll drink it. I prefer Golden Glory. The description made it out to be some wunderkind of citrusy beer and it's not so there we are that's uh that's tonight's beer review uh, that brings us to the end of the vlog i'm afraid tomorrow i've got taekwondo with the boy in the morning and i'm gonna try and get into the little hollow near queen mother's theater do some drone flying in there pardon me hopefully no matter what the weather's like uh it's quite an enclosed little space and we should have some pretty still no windiness See if we can get the drone up and running in there. Try not to crash it into a tree. So we'll see you then. See you tomorrow.